Hey guys, Jason here with Quantum Courses, and in this tutorial, I'll be demonstrating how anyone can use Printful to easily create all over print products to either sell or add to your online store. But before we get started, make sure you hit that subscribe button, the notification bell, and if you want to support the channel, feel free to hit the super thanks button as well. Printful is one of the best places to create high quality all over print products that you can sell under your own brand. You can easily integrate Printful with Shopify, Etsy, eBay, or any other available platform and add your custom products from Printful to create your own e-commerce shop. Simply create a product template, add it to your online shop, and Printful will take care of the production and shipping each time an order is placed. Printful has a vast amount of products that you can customize, including over 70 all over print products in over 15 categories. On Printful, you can easily create all over print t-shirts, hoodies, pillows, backpacks, leggings, and much more. Creating all over print products allows you to cover the entire product with your custom design to create some eye-catching apparel items and accessories. To produce the all over print products, Printful uses cut and sew sublimation where designs are printed on the fabric, cut, and hand sewn into the product you're creating. In this video, I'll be going through the entire process of how to create a design, select an all over print product, add the design to the product template, and publish the product template to your online shop. To sign up to Printful and to follow along, make sure you click the link in the video description or head over to jasongandy.org to sign up for free. So before we create our all over print product, let's first go over a few guidelines and tips that you should follow. These tips will make sure you're creating high quality designs and products for your customers. First, make sure you upload your design in PNG or JPEG format. If your design has transparent areas, then make sure you use PNG. Next, make sure your design is at least 150 DPI. With DPI less than 150, your design could look pixelated or blurry. For shirts, you may want to use 300 DPI to ensure the highest quality. For adjacent colors or colors that are very similar, don't put them too close together. They could actually end up blending and affecting the look of your design. Also, when creating your designs, make sure you fill the template all the way to the edges. Any space not covered will show the bare fabric of your product. Unless you want a specific area to be transparent, make sure you cover it. So in order to make all over print products, you'll first need to create a design. One of my favorite places to create designs for t-shirts and other products is Canva. Canva provides you with tons of pre-made t-shirt design templates that you can easily customize to create your designs. Simply select a pre-made template or choose a blank template and you'll be taken to the Canva editor. With a Canva Pro account, you'll be able to access all the templates, graphics, fonts, images, and other elements available in the Canva library. When creating designs for all over products, make sure you fill out the template all the way to the edges. This will prevent any blank spots from showing on your products. You can also upload your own images, or if you have a Canva Pro account, you could also use images and graphics from the Canva library. To try Canva Pro for free, head over to jasongandy.org or click the link in the video description. So here's my example design to add to my all over print products. This quick design is definitely not the best in the world, but it'll do for this video example. So now that I have my design, let's head back over to Printful and create an all over product. Once you've created your free Printful account using the link in the video description, go ahead and look up at the top right and click your account drop down menu. From here, go ahead and click on go to dashboard. This will take you to your dashboard where you can manage your Printful account. From here, you can integrate Printful with various marketplaces such as eBay or Etsy, view your sales and stats, and create product templates. Since I'm creating an all over print product, let's select the product templates tab from the menu on the left hand side. Here's where you can view all the product templates that you've previously created on Printful and create a new product template as well. So to create my all over print product, let's select the create new product template tab here. This will open up a new window where you can view all the products that are available on Printful. As you can see, they have tons of options to choose from, much more than many other print-on-demand platforms. If you look at the menu on the left-hand side, you can easily browse the categories and the subcategories to find the product that you're looking for. Printful offers many products that you can add all over designs to, so feel free to browse the various selections. 
But for my example all over print product, I think I'm just gonna create a men's t-shirt. So under men's clothing, let's click on all over shirts. On the men's clothing all over shirts page, you can see they have multiple selections. This currently includes a men's crew neck tee, a tank top, a rash guard, and an athletic tee. For my product, I think I'm gonna select the men's crew neck t-shirt. So let's click that now to open up the editor. Here's where you can edit the Printful products to create fully customized items for your store. First, let's check out the product tab from the menu on the left hand side. Here's where you can select the sizes of the product you want to offer, the stitch color you want Printful to use on your product, and where you can upload your design, add text, clip art, and more. If you like, you could click the print area on your product to upload your design, but I'm going to use the choose file button from the menu on the left hand side. This will open up your Printful file library where you can view all the files that you previously uploaded and upload new files to Printful as well. So let's click the upload new file button and find my new design. Once you find your design, go ahead and open it up. Your design will then upload to Printful and once it's finished, you'll be able to view it in the recently used files section. To add it to my product template, let's click on apply. You should now be able to view your design on the product mockup. We are currently on the design view, which is much easier for editing. Make sure you check around all the edges of your product and make sure your design covers all the spaces. On each product, you'll also see a dotted safe print area. Make sure the main part of your design is located here so that it'll be clearly viewable on the product. At the bottom, you can also use the slider bar here to resize your design if needed. And if you look at the menu on the left hand side here, you can see the various layers of your design and their quality. For my design, the print quality is showing average at only 111 dpi. Typically, I would go back and re-export my design at a larger size, but since this is an example product, I'm just gonna let it ride. Currently, we're viewing the front of my t-shirt, but if you look at the top menu, you can also add the design to the back of the t-shirt, the left sleeve, and the right sleeve. Simply select the part of the product you want to edit, and you'll be taken to that part of the product template. When adding a design to a different part of the product, it doesn't have to be the same design you added at first. You can upload whatever you like, making it possible to create some really cool customization. But for the sake of time, I'm just going to add the same design to all parts of my product. Each part of the product may be shaped differently, so make sure you use the Printful tools to edit accordingly. Currently, we're on the design view, which is best for editing your design, but let's check out the 3D view. Here's where you can view a really cool 3D image of your product and see exactly how your design will look. Simply click and drag the 3D image to get a 360 degree view of your entire product. Make sure you review the design on the entire product to see if any changes are needed. If we scroll back up top, we could also click here to see the mock-up view. Here's where you can view a mock-up of your new product and see how it looks on an actual human. And if you scroll down, you can see there are also several other mockups you can view to get a better idea of how your image will look. Take your time and go through each of the various mockups and check out the print areas to make sure they look okay. If you need to make any changes, head back over to the design view and edit your design to get it exactly right. But if everything looks good, go ahead and look at the bottom left of the page and click on the red continue button. Here's where you can give your new product template a title and view all the settings that you selected. If everything looks good, go ahead and click on save product template at the bottom. And voila, I've just created a new custom all over print t-shirt that I can either purchase or add to my online store. Once you've created a new product template, you can select the template and add it to any store that you have connected to Printful. You can integrate Printful with Shopify, eBay, Etsy, WooCommerce, and tons of other platforms to easily set up your own print-on-demand dropshipping store. If you need help integrating Printful with the marketplace, check out the tutorial videos on my channel page going through the process. Once you add your product template to your online shop, customers will be able to make a purchase and the order will automatically be fulfilled by Printful. So that's a quick overview of how to use Printful to create some amazing all-over print products to add to your online store. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and if you're really cool, feel free to hit the super thanks button as well. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.